Here we go again. Well, Daniels flopped their flush draw. That's right. 10 5 3 on the He's flop. He's going to lead out and bet 40,000. Josh with absolutely yeah. nothing with a jack high. And he just calls here. Now he's got no hand and no draw, and he calls 40,000 there, folks. That tells me he's going to try to make a play on this pot later. Here comes the turn. Now a seven of diamonds comes up. Well, Daniel quickly checks. Gives them both straight draws. I notice Josh has made a gut shot straight draw, and eight would give him a straight. He's going to try to bet and pick up this pot right here, though. 225,000 he bets. Daniel, of course, four to the flush, also with a straight draw. Right, a four would give him a straight now. Club would give him a flush. Now he's making this call because of what we call implied odds. If he hits his hand, he can win a lot more chips off of Josh. At least he thinks so. So a big pot developing. River card coming up. Here it is. Oh, it's a four. The joker for Daniel. He has made a seven high straight. Oh, just tremendous. The funky chicken going off in his head right now. Well, he's leading out in bet, and he's going to take the bluff away from Josh. Nice stiff bet. So he's bet 550000 Oh, nice card on the river. Now, Josh, of course, hasn't hit anything. With a four on the river. I'm all in. you got to be kidding. He's going all in here, Vince. Hope you don't got 6-8. That'd be pretty sick. What? A bad time to bluff? I mean, he's raising 470000 more. Yeah, I call. Daniel says he calls it. Oh, my. Well, of course he calls it. He's got the straight. But Josh was betting that he didn't have any. That's going to do it for Josh Aria. Well, folks, the crowd is stunned here. Josh turned straight. up jack nine. Oh, man, and he has just gone down like the Hindenburg. Well, he put in over a million dollars on the river after Daniel bet 550000 in front of him. I'm going to say the shock right now to so take that kind of risk. That was just a total gift. Right now, Josh Aria... Has to be considering jumping off a bridge. Well, you know, Vince, he got here playing fast. He goes out playing fast. But he just didn't believe Daniel. He thought he could go over the top. He didn't believe Daniel caught his straight. This is a gambling kind of player. It's done him well throughout the tournament. This thing backfires in a big way. And that means that we are down to two. Heads up action at the Brigada. Uh, it was a lot of fun, but I'm just, just very disappointed the way I played. I Gave my money away. I played bad from the very beginning and got a little momentum going and then just blew it. I, bad read. I don't know what it is. I just, I'm pretty disappointed.